Hello everyone, I'm Alicia. Welcome to my Beautiful Nights channel. For this video, I'm going to open up another monthly subscription from Check Beads Exclusive. And I will put a link for this subscription down there below the video in case you guys want to go and check out for yourself. So let's see what's inside. I wonder what this month's theme is. Classic Bohemian box. Oh boy sounds really good uh, there's 25 items in this box last month there was actually more items they put them into lots I don't see them doing it though in this month's box so I'm gonna go ahead go through the beads like I usually do with you guys and then I'll figure out what they all are on the paper okay let's see oh these are like uh, rondelles but it's a, it's a different rondelle. It's not rounded on the ends where the holes is at. It's flat. I've gotten these a few times from Check Beads Exclusive. They're pretty neat. And it's a hematite color. And then we have some more rondelles, I think. Are these rondelles? It's hard to tell with the packaging. Let's see. Yes, these are rondelles. <clears throat> Those are nice. I love check rondelles. And we have, oh, these are awesome. I only have this bead in, I think, brown. And I maybe have like eight or ten of them. Not much at all. I don't really know what it's called. I'm thinking it's a rice shape, but it's basically like a check fire polish bead, but it has a rice shape to it instead of the round oval shape. Those are pretty. Really pretty. I love those. Here are some. AB white 6 millimeter fire polish beads. Check fire polish. These are cool. I'll slide them down the bag so you guys can see them better. Those are really neat. And then we have some more rondelles. These are black. And then we have Oh, some more rondelles again. This is a really pretty color. It's like topaz. Those are cool. And then we have some more rondelles. This is a, like an amber color. Like golden. Those are really pretty. It's a honey. It looks exactly like the color of honey. I like that a lot. And then we have some more of the rice-shaped like check fire polish beads but they're green I really love the pink ones they're faceted these are nice I think that these would look really good in that tutorial I did um, what was it called brick stitch fringe earrings something like that these would look awesome in those earrings it was a tutorial I did I think with this box it's been some time but if you go back to, to my videos you'll find it here are some more rondelles these are pink I'm thinking those are rondelles they're not round on the sides they're flat so I'm not totally sure what those are Carl but I think they're like a kind of rondelle wow these are really cool these are eight millimeter check trucks they're like opalite or moonstone color and then they have an AB on them those are really cool I like those and here are some more oh my gosh these are bigger so again they're like the check fire polish beads but they're the rice shape and they're larger where's the other pink ones at these see how they're bigger I really like that shape of bead here are some rondelles. Okay, so like these are the regular check rondelles. See how they're rounded on the sides and these here are flat. But they're very similar. It's an amethyst purple color. Those are nice. I love them. And here are some check teardrops, which I don't have many check teardrops like this. I have the teardrops that has the hole that's going sideways like this but straight down the bead. I really don't have many of these. Those are great. And then we have some check cubes. Clear cubes. 
I wonder if I could make a ring with those. Maybe. And here are some daggers. These are clear. They're big. Those are really big daggers. And there's six of them, so that is enough to make a uh, flower ring. I have several tutorials making uh, beaded flowers, and those would work for a flower. And what are these? Are these cubes? These are really different. I gotta open this. Okay. So, yes, it is a cube, but it's different because there is a dimple on each side. Do you see that there? It's easier to see with the AB side. But there is a little dimple on each side of the cube. Those are really different. I've never seen this bead before. They're pretty cool. So here's your regular check cube. And these ones here have little dimples on them. And now we have some more rondelles. These are purple. And I think that's a cat hair. My cat hair gets everywhere. And then we have some more rondelles. This is the opalite color or moonstone color. I really like this color. It's so cool. Those are pretty. And I am wondering if these would work in a wrap bracelet. The loom style wrap bracelet? That's what I'm thinking. And here are some more rondelles. These are clear. I really like this in the clear color. This is like a rondelle box. I love rondelles. Okay, here are some more teardrops. And they have the center hole again. A really beautiful purple color. I think there's more in this bag than there was in the other bag. Yeah. And then we have leaf beads. And it has the hole that's on the top right there. And by the way, these work great with um, jump rings. They would be awesome in a charm bracelet. This is a nice size too. These are bigger than what they usually give in this box. And here are my favorite check teardrops, the ones that I use for flowers. And I like this color mixture, it's really pretty. It's like a lavender color, amethyst, and then this pale yellow. Those are pretty, love those. So, I could totally make a ring with these, these, and these if I wanted to or I could just do these two but all three of these can be used in a ring I have so many flower ring tutorials and pendants in case you haven't seen them you gotta go check them out here are some more teardrops these are smaller than the other ones and these would work with those fringe earrings I was talking about the brick stitch, brick stitch fringe earrings and it's not enough of them though, there's eight. How many, I think I did five or seven uh, fringe dangles on each earring. Now, there's a lot in this bag, so you will have enough of these. And oh my gosh, you could do graduated sizes. So these are really small, and then these are bigger, so you can have them graduating in teardrop size. That would be really cool the last one some more rondelles and I love this color what is this is it green is it it's not aqua that's a really pretty color it actually looks different on camera on camera it looks more blue but in real life it is more green those are beautiful I want to know what that color is so I can look for more beads in this color that's really pretty I love those. Okay, that's it. So there is a lot of stuff in here. Um, I'm going to go through all of it, figure out what it's called, and I'll be back. I sorted all the beads, and I have noticed that the first one is the White Opal Disc Fire Polish Bead. That name actually sounds really correct 
to me and there's several of these throughout the whole box but I noticed that some of the other ones don't say disc beads they say something else but I'm thinking that that's probably the correct name is the white opal disc fire polished beads and they're six by three millimeters so um they're all probably disc fire polish beads but some of them have different names so I'm gonna go ahead and go through the list with you guys so again the beginning white opal disc fire polish beads they are six by three millimeter and then we have white AB round beads, 8 millimeter, hot metallic jet, jet black fire polish disc beads, 6 by 3, white a, AB round beads, 6 millimeter, opaque jet black fire polished rondelle beads, 6 by 3 millimeter. So here they're, they're saying rondelles. So it's like a, a, a disc rondelle bead. I don't know, it's a strange shape. But it's very much like a rondelle. And then we have yellow Sicilian beads, 6mm by 3mm. Yellow, crystal yellow beads, 6 by 3mm. Lovely pink rose beads, 6 by 3mm. Crystal emerald beads, 6 by 3mm. Crystal purple beads, 6 by 3mm. Fire polished beads, 7 by 4mm. And then we have um, this one, purple teardrop beads, 10 by 7 millimeter, jet black teardrop, 8 by 6 millimeter, and then jet black teardrop, 7 by 5 millimeter. So these are just a little bit smaller than those. And then we have round check glass beads, 5 by 3 millimeter, Rosaline rondelle beads, 6 by 4 millimeter. So these aren't rondelles, but. Um, this one and this one, it was kind of screwy, but this is more of a, it's a fire polish bead, but it's like a rice shape, or oval. And then there is crystal green rondelle beads, those here. And then we have crystal pink rondelle beads. So see, they both say rondelle, but this one is a rosaline, and this one's more of a pink. And then there is crystal round beads. 7 by 4 millimeter and then we have jet black teardrop beads 10 by 7 millimeter and then there is crystal Q beads 5 by 5.5 millimeter that's a strange size and then there is crystal leaf beads 17 by 7 millimeter and then crystal ABQ beads 6 by 5 millimeter and crystal leaf beads 9 by 9 millimeter and Mixed teardrop beads, six by four millimeter. So this is all the stuff in the box, and again, I will put a link for the monthly subscription, Check Beads Exclusive, down there so you guys can go and check it out for yourself. So this is it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please like this video, leave me a comment, subscribe if you wanna see more of my videos. Make sure you click the bell button so you get notified when I upload new videos, and like me on Facebook. And don't forget to share pictures of the jewelry you've made from my videos on my Facebook page, and follow me on Pinterest. Thanks for watching.